Like my hair never used to bounce like this. Like I'm telling you something. I'm giving you giving you news. Like my hair used to never bounce like this. I'm a 4C hair and I never used to just. Natural girls can, natural girls can swing their hair too. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Keisha Anilika. Thank you for coming back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. I appreciate you for showing up. Go ahead and just hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you haven't, I don't know why. Also go ahead that bell button because if you hit the bell button, then you know every single time that I upload. Now with the uploads, listen, so I'm a mother, right? So <laughs> it's like even being able to do this upload right now is like... It's, it's, it's a lot. I'm trying to get back into the groove of things. I'm trying to keep videos coming out. So what I think I'm going to do is actually film probably anywhere in between two to three, two to four videos in one day. So that all I have to worry about is editing. Cause I feel like even though it's not easy, it's easier for me to cut out time to actually edit um, my videos. Yeah, I don't know if you noticed anything different, but I, your girl got a new camera. <laughs> I mean, listen, shout out to Teresa for letting me know about this camera. The other camera I had, the Nikon, I was struggling with it. Like, the fo I had no autofocus, so it's like anytime I moved, blah, 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 like it never caught up with me. So like, I was like, I have to get another camera. This Panasonic Lumix camera, the G7. Yeah, this is kind of what's up. You know, I mean, it's good still. It, it's still a starter camera. It's, I feel like the top people even have even better $1,200 cameras. I ain't about to spend that, but, you know, this is still good to go. I mean, still making me look a little washed out a little bit. I'm a little darker than this right now. But yeah, I mean, I do got two big um, soft boxes right in front of me. I do not have a ring light, so probably I look a little light or something. To get into this video, I just wanted to do a super quick video on natural a natural hairstyle. For me, I am I'm a natural girl, like I have natural hairstyle, but I always braid it up, put it under a wig. If you see me out with my natural hair, it'll be like one, two days tops. Like I can't do that. I can't. Uh. And I live in Texas, and it's like, bro, the heat. Like I don't. I don't get it. Nowadays, I am kind of letting my hair breathe. My hair has grown tremendously since I cut it all down since um, 2016. So my hair has grown tremendously. I do want to color because for some reason, I do not care for the color black hair. I feel like it's so harsh on me. I feel like it's just dark for me, even though that's what I was born with. Once a week, I do the actual full-on step routine like the shampoo conditioner um I'm a hot oil treatment if i need to do it all of that but girl i mean not everybody has time for everything so it's like i just use a co-wash keep it going my hair's still growing i'm very fine with that you know and so that's all i did and so i did the co-wash and then after that i used the cantu argan oil leave-in conditioner i love this thing like when I tell you when my hair feels so dry and just I, I I take my hair as like I'm it's like a plant so it's like I want to hydrate it so I always use this if anything I don't know if y'all can see it if anything I use this yes I'm out <laughs> I like use like the last drop of it so I need to get another one but it's like I love 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 this so I put that all over my hair and I actually ended up this is a real story so I went into Walmart to go get another one of the leave-in conditioner and I quickly went in there because I went to do my workout went to Walmart quickly got some white container and then came back home when I came back home I came back with the coconut curling cream that I um that I don't know if y'all can see that and I was like dang I did not get my leave-in conditioner so I ended up using 
what I had left of this leave-in conditioner and then this curling cream so hopefully my hair turns out okay or decent or whatever yeah so I put this all over my hair too then I just twisted up my hair and slept with it damp and wet and just put it in a scarf uh, my hair has actually been twisted for like a full day so it's kind of really dry right now so let me unveil unveil <laughs> I thought like, this is some braids I feel like I like kind of had when I was in elementary school I remember when I went to school still with kind of braids not this thick but still with braids this guy that I liked he like made fun of me and I was like oh my gosh I'm wearing dookie braids like these braids in middle school and nobody does that like I literally looked around <laughs> Like, I literally looked around at the other black people, lack thereof, that we had, but the other black people that, but the black girls, and I was like, oh, we're not supposed to have braids anymore. So, <laughs> it's whatever. So I just twisted them up, just two strand. I don't know how to do the three strands yet, but just the two strand. My hair's grown significantly. 2016, it was probably, this whole braid wasn't here. Like, it was that short. Like, it was an inch and a half or two inches, like, up here. Now, 2018, it's down here. It's like, I want to get... A blowout but I kind of still probably want to wait and I cut my hair twice a year so I cut my hair every January and every June so I am due for a cut yeah so we're just gonna twist it out and see what we're gonna do with this see how it goes why I did big twist was because I was tired <laughs> I was like literally in a rush I was tired I was in a rush like on my way to I think like night service like church or something and it's like I, I could have stand there and just do like bitty bitty um twist like I'm not about to sit here and do that so after I twisted it out I, I just go ahead and kind of separate it a little bit like like when it comes to like the natural hairstyle, it's kind of like, bro, it's like it's not that deep because I feel like the whole natural movement is all about basically being yourself. So if your hair or curl pattern is a certain type of curl or it waves a certain way, it jig jags the other way, it's kind of like the natural people of the world kind of look at it like, okay, that's her thing. That's how her hair grows, you know? kind of all out so you still just want to kind of separate it but you can't I hate the back because it always flips out like if you've had it in the twist for so long or you twist it a certain way like a nonchalant just twist in the back whatever it's gonna flip out the way that you twist it at least it does for my hair it's supposed to be a quick get ready now now I'm all self-conscious of how my curl pattern is I just told you shit it. your hair it is how it is how it is I'm going to try to create like a it's a nice nice cute separation but see I hate that I hate that wish it would just be down I'm gonna pull it down right there okay wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute I'm gonna use the end of my makeup brush my eyebrow brush don't judge me this is what I have It's kind of wide and that's due to um, hair loss whenever I was pregnant and you'll and I'll talk about that more in my pregnancy video I got a lot of hair loss I'm still losing some hair a little bit I'm still within the first year of my child of my kids so I kind of expect it but I've been taking my prenatals and you know trying to massage my head and everything so you can always go like this leave your hair like this keep it going and literally that's the end of the the video or whatever if you want to create a little bit of cuteness like your hair is already cute but if you want to create a little bit more you know i know about style and i know about design so let me create something i feel like i need to like correct the way i'm looking while i braid because i'll be like Looking like I'm just struggling, but it's like I'm not. It's like, 
it's just my, I guess, go-to face or something. Keep going behind your ear just so it can kind of stay in place. I'm not gonna put rubber bands on that. I don't like using rubber bands on my natural hair when it's not blown out just because it's like I don't want any type of weird tangling or whatever. So I just let it hang right there. I don't know if y'all can see. Like it's not like really, really cute or anything, but it's still just like something on the side of your head. So to make it a little more amplified, I'm gonna use these um, beads. Filling treat, I have no idea what it's called. Filling, filig, filig, filigree two? Filigree two? Y'all know what these are, but I'm gonna use these. I'm just gonna really just place it along the braid or the twist. Yeah, they just fell all over the floor. It's great. One more to kind of secure that twist so it doesn't come out. These, like, you clamp it to the tightest that you want if you haven't used these already, you know. I mean, you're like, I know, girl. <laughs> like, okay, sorry. I'm just letting you know. Okay, and that's the braid. So that's said and done. So I want to go ahead and use my 24 hour Edge Tamer Extreme Firm Hold from Eben. If y'all can see that. Probably not. I don't know. This has worked great for me. I haven't seen a real problem with it. It holds better than the Hicks that I use, definitely holds better than the olive oil Edge Control. Upset about this Eco Style gel? What the heck? Like I bought a huge tube of it, not tube, a huge tub of it, because I'm like, okay, anytime I slick my hair back, that's what I'm gonna be using. And I'm like over here, like, what? It causes what? It does what? I'm not gonna lie. Let me tell you something. Let me give you the truth. Let me give you the tea. It's, let me let you know something. After I heard, after my sister in law told me about the Eco Style gel, I still used it about three times after that. <laughs> Like, I know it was bad for you, but listen, Linda, listen, 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 listen. <laughs> That's all I had to use at the second. I didn't have time to go buy another one, nothing like that. So, I want this whiteness to go away because I know it has to dry down and the, the light's actually making it worse than what it actually looks like in real life. Before I say that, I do use the Kaleidoscope uh, Miracle Drops, usually on my braids. I don't know if y'all can see that at all. Just type it in, I'll probably leave the link on the bottom or something. But this Kaleidoscope Hair Growth Drops, um, I use the, I use this while my hair is in braids, just so I can get it everywhere in the scalp. It, it work, I feel like it works. But for all I know, a little bit of water, some oils if you want, just to kind of, Soften it up just a little bit. Do like an actual bang or something if you want to, because you still got this showing and stuff. Sorry, I had popcorn earlier. You can put it out in the front. You can swing it all the way over. I will tell you now, I will tell you this. Listen, this curling cream from Cantu, the flaking, I don't like that. Like, I really don't. This is my first time using that. I don't like that. Because it makes it seem like it's dangerous and it's not dangerous at all. I really do want to see how my hair is when I do blow it out because, baby, the shrinkage is real. Because look, like, it's this short, but if I take this down, it's like it's long. Look at that. Oop, just messed up my hair. But yeah, y'all get it. But anyways, um, yeah, y'all, how y'all like this? Oh, I messed up, I messed up my hair just trying to show y'all how long my hair really is. Look at that, put that inside real quick. It was just like a quick, hey girl, get up and go, um, um, natural hairstyle that you can do. So simple, so easy to do. Um, if you don't know how to do the twist, I probably just recommend probably kind of sleeking it up and putting bobby pins across here so you still have that kind of smooth look on one side. Yeah, I think it's totally cute. I mean, I like it. Don't forget to like this video and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. So I will see you guys in another video. See y'all later.